Hey guys, it's Rara Lay. And today I want to make sure that you guys go ahead and check out RaraLay.com, bringing you the latest in celebrity news, prop reviews, and entertainment. So you get all the tea and all the gossip and keep up to date. And also you can check me out on YouTube at youtube.com slash RaraLay. And make sure you subscribe to our channel as well as Instagram, RaraLay, and Twitter at RLTV Media. Again, that's RLTV Media. Make sure you... Hello, I'm your host, Rara Lay, and I am here with RLTV today with Aisha Marie. Hello, Aisha. How are you? I'm good. I just actually got off a photo shoot right now. I can tell you look good. Thank you. Thank you. How was the photo shoot? It was good. It was good. What was it for? For the new show that I'm doing. I heard that you were actually starring on a new reality TV show. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Yes. It's called... Um, Vices of Venus, mm -hmm. and it's about women like rebuilding their image, you know, look more about women empowering themselves and stuff. It's really an awesome show. I'm excited to be working with it. Can you tell me a little bit about the cast? I know that you're definitely celebrity starring on it, but there are there are any other people that are participating in it? Yes, I actually have um, Des Destiny, Henshaw, and Wanda. Who would you say that you're the closest with on the cast? I would say Destiny, the closest. Closest with her. I actually hang out with her more. Okay. Yeah. Um, so you're from Miami as well? Yes. How do you like Miami? I love it. It's home. There's nothing like Miami. We're actually in the DMV right now, so have you been to the DMV before? Never. It's my first time. So compared to the DMV and Miami, which one would you say? <laughs> it's cold over here. It's so cold. I Miami weather is the best. It's warm year round. I heard it was like 90 the other week. Yeah, yeah, so it's different. even the winter is like 70 degrees, 60 degrees, so that's our winter over there. I'm not used to this cold weather. You can see I'm a little bit sick. Oh, <laughs> but you're covering up well. You look beautiful right now. <laughs> so um, you told us a little bit about that project, but are there any other projects that um, you've worked with in the past that you're working on now that you would wish to address? Um, I actually have a t-shirt line coming out. I want to um, put merchandise on my site, so I will have my shirts out soon. But I've done packs and shirts with packs in it. Um, you can find them now there uh, with Fan Styles. I work also with Fan Styles. And I mean, that's about it right now. Okay. In your future, are there any other projects that you plan to work on that you feel like that you have coming up? Um, well, right now, my next move is a cover. I want to get a cover, so that's my next move. Have you been talking to anybody? Um, I've been talking. I've done a lot of um, shoots with um, Black Man and Smooth. Mm -hmm. I've been with them, but I haven't got a cover yet, so I've been in the works with Black Man. Okay, so you're a beautiful woman, and I just have to ask, like, are you single? Are you taken? <laughs> I'm single right now. Okay. I don't have time for a boyfriend right now. I'm just working. Because you're busy. Yeah, I'm always on the road, always out. No time. And working with like a lot of different people, um, I know that you may be single now, but in the past, has there, has there been anyone in the industry that you actually have dated? Yes, there was. Okay. Um, in the past. <laughs> Who in the past did you date? <coughs> I'm not going to say any names, but... No, I mean, I've, I've dated someone in the media. Okay. Um, I'm pretty sure everyone knows already. Because I, I heard you were dating Trey Songz. Yeah, okay. I was in the past. We dated a few times, a couple months. Mm -hmm. But I mean, we're still good, really good friends. We're not dating anymore. And that's good. Yeah. It's always good to like, still keep talk. Always I feel like he'll always have a place in my heart, always. Like, will always be cool. So it's just we're going different directions. Like, he's, you know, he's Trey Sons. Right. He's a ladies' man, so. And that can be difficult sometimes. Like yeah, a lot of times, it's very like, hard. It's hard very to date hard. a ladies' man. Very hard. Do you see yourself maybe dating somebody else, or is anyone you have your eye on, even though you're single, but <laughs> you could be mingling, maybe? <laughs> no, definitely. I mean, I have, I have a friend. I have friends, but I'm not looking at anyone serious right now. Right. Like, not, not at this moment. I always like to ask people because a lot of times the media they misconstrue things and they might. Like, we only get clips of everything. We don't really get the inside scoop. But um, 
is there anything like you would want to clarify? Is there anything that uh, basically, what is the real you? Like, tell us about you. Tell us like who you are. What would you want everyone to actually really know about you? I mean, I just want everyone to know like I'm actually a very down to earth person. I'm not like flashy at all. I love to just chill, hang out. I'm not into like, all that crazy stuff. So people might think of me like as a video girl, I'm always out in the club, but that's work for me. Right. It's all work. So once you get really get to know me, you see. And I'm just like a whole body. I love to chill. I'm real humble. Right. <laughs> and um, you mentioned the videos though. Like, what videos have you done so far? I've done a lot of videos. Um, no New Friends, Drake, I've worked with the guy. Oh, that's me. a big video. That's amazing. Videos, over 20 videos. Wow. I can't name all of them. Exactly. But I've worked with a lot of famous people. And I feel like you still will have a lot of that work coming in. Have you like, so you've done modeling with videos. Um, are there any other industries like modeling aspects that you would want to pursue? Like maybe runway or something? Because I mean, I saw a little snippet of what you were doing and it looked like maybe you could rip the runway a little bit. I've done a um, um, function fashion week in Miami, mm -hmm. which was, I mean, it's like an adrenaline rush. Like, it's, I love it. Mm -hmm. Runway is like awesome. It's just nerve wracking, too. How tall are you? I'm 5'5. Five five. Okay, but then uh, definitely, I can still see, like, with the runway, you can definitely still do that, especially like, how tall are the heels you're wearing right um, now? Six, like, maybe? Maybe. Yeah. Maybe. With your nice little red bottoms, I see. Those are nice. <laughs> yeah. It's the legs, too. The legs make me look tall. Yeah. And that tan. That must be Miami. That's because in Miami. Miami, you're not getting that tan. <laughs> no. Okay, well, it's definitely been great having you here. Well, besides your modeling career, um, I've been hearing a few things about you acting. Can you tell me a little bit about your acting career? Are you pursuing it? What's well, going on? I'm actually looking to get into a couple of classes now. I haven't started anything yet, mm -hmm. but it's something I definitely look forward to doing. Like that's one of my goals is to get into a movie, definitely. What kind of role would you play? Like, are you like crazy? <laughs> the like beautiful play? Like, what kind of? What's your attitude? You <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean I have no idea. I have to break out of my show. I just. Right. Well, I definitely see, like, I can see you doing that. Um, is there anyone you emulate, like, that you look up to inside the acting industry? I love J-Lo. J-Lo's one of my biggest inspirations. I feel like she she started from the bottom and she worked, now she has a whole empire. Though. Jenny from the block. Yeah, Jenny from the <laughs> <laughs> She definitely does. I love her. And then she's Puerto Rican, too, so. Oh, you're Puerto Rican? Yeah, I'm Puerto Rican. Oh, okay, fully Puerto Rican? I'm Puerto Rican and Cuban. My dad's Cuban. Okay. So... Wait, did, were you born here or did you come over? I was born in New Jersey. Okay. So, between New Jersey and Miami, is it a lot different? It's two different worlds. It's like, because you got to they have Jersey Shore, but that doesn't compare to Miami, no. Uh, <laughs> and where I come from in Jersey is like, um, like a little town. It's mm -hmm. very like farm like. It's like a farm. Right. So, in Miami, it's a big city, people everywhere hot women everywhere. Yeah. Well, you fit right in there. <laughs> what made you move from Jersey to Miami? Well, my dad's family is in Miami. Oh, okay. That makes sense. From Jersey. But um, she decided to move when I was young, mm -hmm. when I was like 12. So I was raised in Miami. Oh, Miami okay. So you've been there for a while. Yeah. Okay. It was a pleasure having you on my show. Um, Definitely keep in touch. When I come to Miami, I expect to hit you up <laughs> so you can show me because uh, Maryland, I don't think Maryland has too much on Miami right now. Take you out on me. Okay. Well, it's been great. You've been watching RLTV with your host, Rara Lay and Aisha Marie. Peace out. We're rocking out now. <laughs>